you get any phlegm now, yeah. let me know because I'd like a sample of it. So, uh, yeah, which one? Which one you choose? There you go. So your oxygen levels are good, 99%. Your pulse is nice as well. Let's have a think about things because you've had this cough for a week and a half. Now you're coughing up blood. Your chest sounds reasonably clear when I'm having a listen to it. It's not obviously an infection when I'm having a listen there. All right. But that doesn't give us an idea of what is going on. Okay. One thing that makes you cough up blood, not that rare in Bradford, to be fair, but TB, tuberculosis. Okay. Uh, sounds like a bit of an old disease, <laughs> but we know that with an influx of people from different backgrounds in Bradford, it comes and goes yeah. in, in phases. There are other more worrying things. I don't think we need to worry about anything like lung cancer with you because of your age, but you do have a smoking history. Okay. And I'd like to send you for a chest x-ray to see what might be going on there. Yeah. I'm not convinced that this is just a simple chest infection and you're coughing forcefully and you're bringing up some blood. Yeah. It just sounds a bit iffy. And with the history of you having some chemical and fire exposure as well, I just want to have a closer look at some of the glands inside of your chest and the lungs as well. OK. Do you think you'd be able to go for a chest X-ray this morning? Yeah. Yeah? yeah that's fine. If you can go today, I should get uh, the result back by about Thursday time. <coughs> Why don't I phone you with the results and then we yeah, can go fine. through it there? All right. Nice Brilliant. to see you, mate. Nice Cheers. See you later. See you later. Bye. <coughs> Oh, <coughs>